All right, guys. So we got another leg day going on. We're gonna start off with deadlift, um, lightweight, time under tension. We're gonna try to keep tension on the muscle all the way from top to bottom. We'll have a little bit of shortened range, so you'll see that we won't go up all the way for muscle reps. When we get close to the end, uh, we might because lower back gets a little sore. And, uh, so keep up with us and we'll see what's going on after that. We'll get some squats, get some quads, some hamstrings, some calves, and uh, get this thing on before we start the strength challenge starting next week. Keep up, guys. Go past your toes, so focus on your quads. Bring your feet back a little more. There you go. All right now, emphasize on the quads. We do three sets of uh, 15 to 20 on this, and then we'll go to switch our feet to far out and wide. Focus on the glutes and the hamstrings. And then we'll do three sets of that, probably 12 to 15, uh, maybe 15 to 20. We'll see.
have it now guys and uh here's a modified version of the leg raises right here we're gonna bring our legs up hit the lower ass but then curl up and crunch our whole abdominal or rectus abdominal so we can get those six pack abs eight pack whatever you you're made with uh, we're gonna try to develop those so when we take the fat off of them we can actually see these things all right No Alright, so I'm gonna try Dragonfly legs. I haven't done them in years since I was a personal trainer. And uh, <laughs> so this is really good for your core and uh, overall body support. What's up guys so it was a great leg workout i'm sure you've seen it uh it was in the video or well, in this video before this um super leg pump my legs are killing me they're throbbing or not killing me but they feel great they're throbbing feel swole um like they're about to bust out of skin that's for your whole legs to be pumped that's an amazing feeling to, i think so anyways but on with it i'm um, going home to grill some chicken on the grill of course that's how you grill chicken but um i haven't told anybody on social media youtube or whatever that me and carrie have quit keto um not that it wasn't working for us it was working great um and it's easy for me and carrie as far as like planning out food because it's easy to go around and get something that is moderate protein high fat i think so i mean you pretty much go get burgers and just take the buns off or get some wings protein's a little high but your fat's good as long as you get non-breaded uh dry rub um but we started car uh intermittent fasting which we was doing that already but we uh paired it with carb cycling so we're doing um three days a week we're doing low carb or 25 percent of our um our body weight we're do, like times that uh, by 0.25 and that's our carbs for three days and then the other three days it's um half a gram per pound and then on saturday which is our refeed day we go anywhere from two grams per pound to four grams um we'll probably stay closer to the two grams um but we'll see how it goes um but yeah there's so many diets that work guys um keto is amazing i love keto it's great will i do it again of course probably every time i cut well eventually but um carbs are great it's all about what works for you guys um i mean mo uh, there's so many meal plans out there so many mac different macros and a lot of them work um keto's a little different than most of them but most um diets you can just reduce your calories by 200 to 500 uh, below your maintenance and then you're going to lose weight um same with increasing weight you increase your calories 200 300 500 calories a day you're going to increase weight now depending on what you're doing working out what types of workout um are you sitting around are you active depends on if you're going to build muscle you're going to lose weight things like that but the main thing is is it sustainable i think keto sustainable for me and it, carry not so much but not saying that there's anything against that it's just some people like eating like that some people don't it's up to you it's personal it's individual uh, there's no right or wrong i mean as far as which diet plan is whatever works for you whatever I mean, don't be going crazy and like eating retarded stuff that just, you know is going to give you cancer or like go eat rocks. Yeah, you're going to gain some weight if you eat rocks. I guarantee it. You want to gain five pounds, start eating rocks. But, um, but what I want to get to is that we started carb cycling because we're going to eat carbs on our cruise. And we don't want to go from no carbs or very, 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 very low carbs to high carbs on the cruise because there's going to be drinks there's going to be foods that we're going to enjoy ourselves um i mean we're still going to be 
like being healthy for the most part but we're gonna have fun and we don't want it to blow back and us to rebound a lot of weight so we're being smart about it and we're going ahead and introducing carbs early on and then we'll slowly increase them I will I don't know about Carrie because she still needs to lose a good bit of weight but I don't need to lose anymore but I want to lose a little bit more so when I start putting on muscle that it's it's a little bit longer of me being into the the muscle building phase the mass building phase before I start seeing the fat accumulate so we both have different goals but right now I'm maintaining trying to lose a little bit but she's still trying to lose a good bit so I'm encouraging her I'd like for y'all guys to encourage her leave us some comments guys if you have questions about keto about intermittent fasting about carb cycling about nutrition in general I mean I've been studying this stuff for a long time I read articles like crazy I look at like scientific literature watching videos like crazy I mean I like to know how things work I like to know how things don't work I like to know the answers of things because I like to I like to know I like to be the guy that somebody can come to and say hey what's up with this and I can give my an answer if I don't if I can't give you an answer I'm probably gonna check it out and try to learn as much as I can about it that way I could give you my opinion or what what I get out of the, the data that is available to us. So, um, leave some comments, questions, motivation. And uh, in the comments, let me know why y'all guys watch me and Carrie. Is it for the workout motivation, the weight loss motivation? Uh, you think we're hot and you just like seeing us get shredded? Um, you like seeing the family, a couple, a husband and wife working out together? Um, something that you don't see a lot? Just let me know, guys why you watch us and what you want to see in the comments i love you guys and stay tuned because i'm dropping videos i'm going to prove y'all y'all going to want to watch what i'm doing it might take a couple years before i become famous i don't know if i want to become famous but i just want to make a difference in people's lives that's really it. i want to motivate somebody to get off the couch to change their life to take action to get up and do it it don't have to be fitness i mean fitness is a great thing but get up and do it. It might be your dream. It might be your dream job. It might be a place you want to go. It might be something you want to do, a business you want to start. But nothing's going to happen until you get up and make it happen. You can sit on your butt and want it or wish for it all you want. But it ain't going to come to you until you work for it. So put in work. And things take time, guys. You got to have perseverance and you got to have patience. You got to push through. Because... Things that are worth having take time to acquire, guys. Muscle takes time to acquire. A good physique takes time to acquire. Losing weight takes time to acquire. A business, a career takes time to acquire. I mean, strong financial stability. Yeah, financial stability takes time to acquire. Guys, you don't have to go out here and be trying to show off with your money or whatever. Do you... Stay in your own lane. Focus on you. Use people for motivation. Don't let people bring you down. And just do it. Get to work. Why not? Why? What's your excuse? If you really want it, you'll get it done. That's it, guys.